and welcome today to a video diary. It's me. The most fabulous person you've ever met in your entire life. It's me. <laughs> Can't believe it. <laughs> well, I'm here. And, well, I've experienced my first day. And, uh, haven't had the interview yet because they keep pushing me back. Pushing. It's like they're trying to push me away, push me off a bridge. <clears throat> but... It's something I guess you have to get used to around here, because people are really pushy, and they just, you know, they're just pushing, and it's like them push pops, it's not like a ring pop, it's, um, it's always in a hurry, always in a hurry, squeeze, squeeze pop. <clears throat> um, well, I met a couple people, um, I met this girl that I don't remember her name, and, uh, she lent me a couple dollars and let me run down to the nearest crack base dealer and, um, you know, spoon it, so to speak. So, and, uh, she, you know, she was cool with that. She, she understood what everything was about there. And, um, I, I, you know, at least I come forward and I'm honest. And I'm real. And I don't leave questions to be unanswered. And I'm real honest. And I take care of everything. And um, I'm really responsible. And, um, you know, it's how it is when you have to be an adult. You just can't be living life to the moment like you used to when you were young. It just doesn't work that way when you get old. It's not the same. People just, you know, they don't, they don't understand that. And there's nothing you could do for them. There's, you know, you try to be cool, and you try to be serious, and you really try to get into that. You try to tell them who is boss, what's going on, with who's what's what's what buddy that didn't even know somebody, one buddy didn't know nobody, that you didn't know, and they knew. And you couldn't help that whole thing just by saying, what's up? So, really, what I'm trying to get to the point of is that you gotta be honest, you know? You gotta be straightforward. You have to be kind, acting, sincere, and blunt at the same time, which is difficult for some people because they don't understand. And that's another thing what this is all about, is that people just don't understand. I don't know why, but they don't? There's nothing you could do for people like that. So, my suge suggestion is, as I heard from my Chinese sister, Hu Long Wong Wong Xin, this ancient symbol of good luck, but not anymore. Good luck? But not anymore. Simple to live by, you know? And I'm going to leave you with those words. I'm going to let you ponder and let you simmer in that a little bit and let you think and give you some time. It's been hectic for me too. Um, I have a phone call coming up soon and I don't think it's wonderful. Um, I'm sure I can fill you in later, but it's awful. It has to do with my vagina and some pop rocks and one really bad night on the 4th of July and 15 guys that I used to know from a fraternity but that I didn't know anymore, but then all of a sudden I hooked up with one of them and then one of them knew 15 of these other guys and they weren't the same guys that I thought they were and it was a horrible trick that they played on me. So, taking care of business. And try to be me, and it's okay. So, try to understand if you don't understand. And really get it together and be real. And find everything out. I mean, that's, that's all I can be. I, that's all I can really leave you with today. And, um, I love you. And, spermicide.